Welcome to Google Wednesday. Today we're going to be talking about how to change your signature at the bottom of your email. So first go ahead and log into Google or Google Apps and then click settings in the top right hand corner. Under the general tab about halfway down it'll say signature and if you have no signature checked go ahead and click the one under it with your email address next to it. So we're going to delete the signature we have and just start adding one. So there's my name. I'll add my email address. Uh, to make it a link, just go ahead and highlight it and click the blue link thing and it automatically makes it a link for you. And then we'll put in a phone number and then you can bold, italicize, underline, change the fonts, uh, the text sizes, the colors, highlight things and then add a picture. A lot of people ask about adding a picture because you can't just upload a picture, you have to use one from the web. So let's add a picture to this. We'll click the picture button and it's asking for the image URL. So basically you need an image that is somewhere on the internet. So we'll click over to our site and here's an image right here that we'd like to use. If you right click it in Firefox, Chrome, or Safari It'll give you an option to copy the image URL. So we'll go ahead and do that. And we'll switch back to Google Apps. And we'll paste that URL in the box. And it shows us a preview of what we had. So that works for us. It's a little large, but we'll have to change it. So click OK. And now the picture is inserted in my signature. And then we'll make it a little smaller by clicking, let's see, medium, we'll do small. So that's perfect, now we have a little image. This can be used for Facebook buttons, Twitter buttons, your RSS feed, or even your handwritten signature. When you're done, go ahead to the bottom and click Save. And when you compose a new message, it'll show your image and everything you wrote right at the bottom. Again, if you have any questions or there's some tutorials you wanna see about Google Apps, feel free to leave a comment below. Thanks.